Hello, everybody! This is your boy Duke coming at you with my review of episode 4 of Beyond the Boundary. Okay, let's go at it. First off, this episode, of course, picks up where the last one left off uh, with Miria uh, fighting Sakura and um, this huge battle. But that wasn't the. We learn more in this episode about main ca the characters. We learn that um, mm -hmm. why Akito said to Miria, "You don't know what you're talking about." When she said, "You can't understand what it's like being dangerous and different and left out and everything," and um, because there's this the huge battle, and then. A lot of it's, like, confusing. It's like, well, what am I looking at type things? Because they're going through this labyrinth of their memories and everything. And um, they finally get out. And Maria says to Akito, um, stay back. Her blood rains down. And it disintegrates everything it touches. Which was, like, whoa, we learned more about Miriam and her um, blood. Why... It's cursed and everything. Why like she comes from a cursed clan? Um, and um, on top of that, um, um, we um, learn more about Akito because um, what happens? Is, I'm loving what happened is um, he gets possessed by the um, hollow shadow, which is causing all this prob trouble, and he tells Miria to, um, stab him, to run it out of his body by running him through with her blood sword, um, which does, but leaves him, um, very weakened, in a very weakened state, and we finally understand why he can relate to her, because... He's at the brink of death, and his Yomu um, side comes out. And he goes fucking ballistic. They have to use this, like, spirit cage type thing to hold him in. And I'm like, whoa. He's not always this nice guy. When he fucking loses it, he will fucking kill anything in his path. He doesn't, re he doesn't recognize friend, foe, anything. He just loses it. So... This was a really good episode with this. We learn more about these characters, more what they go through, more of everything. I'm looking really forward to it more because the very ending of the episode turns out they think they didn't get the um, Hollow Shadow, though it was a fake. But I guess someone else got it. Because someone else says, here we go, we have the Hollow Shadow. So, and I love the line. He goes, she goes, oh, you're still my son. Um, Creepy Semboy has a thing who has a thing for glasses, which is always wonderful because I want to see this relationship grow. I want to see it get better. I want to see it get stronger. I want to see more. So that was pretty much the episode. Um, again, recap: the chase, the craziness, learning more about Akito, his Yomu side, uh, and maybe there seems to be something underground going on that we don't know about yet. So, this is the old boy in to say. If you like this video, please click like. If you want to see more, please subscribe. This is the old boy in to say. Oh!